we'd like to demonstrate some of the tools that we might use uh, in our program here that, that would be used for a uh, thousand volts or less here. Uh, one of the things I'd like to demonstrate also, no rings, no watches. Anytime we don the PPE, none of that metal. Also, any metal in your pockets, any change, any pocket knife, uh, anything that's going to absorb heat. We want to make sure that we take everything out of our pockets here, nothing there. Uh, when we come to the multimeter, we want to make sure that we've got the right category rating here. If I'm going to be in the service equipment, CAT, three, cat 4, uh, 600 volt, CAT 3, 1000 volt here with this T5 1000 that we might use. So using the appropriate category rated meter. Also the appropriate insulated tools right here. Uh, they make sure that they have the international symbol here, the double triangles there for the appropriate insulated tool. Also, we'll demonstrate and go through the procedure for locking out and tagging out the breaker that we'll be doing the switching on and testing for voltage here. The appropriate PPE for racking in and out. We'll need a 40 calorie suit, double layer switching hood here. I'll go through these items. We're going to need hearing protection. We're going to need safety glasses under the hood. The double layer switching hood here, 40 calories. Uh, this hood also has ventilation in it that we can use for those days when it's hot. Also, the coat here, got a 40 calorie coat. Again, you'll notice this zipper. Uh, this is made of Nomex. Also, Nomex to fasten the front of it right here. So, for the coat right there, also. Then we're going to have the pants right here, kind of like a bib overall. These are also rated 40 calories. So the appropriate size of the equipment here is to dawn. Uh, I'm going to dawn all this equipment and do a switching, a racking in and out. We'll be back with you in a few minutes. Okay, we want to talk about the label on the equipment here. When we look at the label, we want to look at the flash protection boundary. This flash protection boundary listed on this piece of equipment is five foot and one inches. That means that we're going to have to set up a boundary here. You can see that we've got the stanchions and the chains. We've also got a danger high voltage uh, or exposed live parts warning label here, warning unqualified people to stay out. So we would set up the flash protection boundary at five foot one, in this case right here for this piece of equipment. Now here's here for locking out and tagging out and racking the breaker out. 